Hello kids, welcome to Learner's Planet. Kids, this is our first session for DMAS. What is DMAS? That is the short form for Division, Multiplication, Addition and Subtraction. Now why I have written in this order, right? Generally you learn uh, addition, then subtraction, then multiplication and then division. But I have written uh, it in some other order that is DMAS, Division, Multiplication, Addition and Subtraction. So what is the suspense behind this? Okay, so let's uh, come to the point. Suppose your teacher has given you a calculation, right? I just write a calculation for you. 6 divided by 2 plus uh, 1, okay? Now you are solving it, uh, okay, 6 divided by 2 is 3 and 3 plus 1, 4. So 3 plus 1, 4. Okay, what I what have you have you done? Six divided by two, that is three, and then plus one, so that is four. Now one of your friend is doing six divided by two plus one, that is three. Six divided by three is what? Two. Now you are getting this answer, and your friend is getting this answer. Now, why both of you are getting different answers? So the calculation is same, 6 divided by 2 plus 1, 6 divided by 2 plus 1, right? So what's behind this and why both of you are getting different answers and who is correct? Okay, so that's a big question and because of that we are going to study this topic D mass, right? What is D mass? That is order of operations, okay? order of operations. Now what are operations? Operations we have addition, subtraction, multiplication and division. Right? So these are the four basic operations in mathematics and what should be the order of performing these operations that is actually important. Right? So because of that we are going to study this topic order of operations and D mass. Okay, so let's begin this interesting journey of D mass. Now let's discuss what, discuss what exactly D mass is and what does it say. See what D mass says, the order of operation, that is the correct order of operation is D M A S, that is division, multiplication, addition and subtraction, right? So if you have multiple operations to do, then how would you perform the operation? In which order? So first of all, you will perform division, then multiplication, then addition and then subtraction, right? D for division, M for multiplication, A for addition and S for subtraction. Right? So D, M, A, S. When you have all the four operations, then first of all you will perform division, then you will perform multiplication, then you will perform addition and then subtraction. So this is the order of operation and you have to strictly follow it otherwise you will uh, get wrong answers now what is happening in this case just see to it uh, 6 divided by 2 plus 1 here you are getting 4 and 6 divided by 2 plus 1 here you are getting 2 why because the order of operation over here and here it's different in this case what you are doing first of all you are dividing 6 divided by 2 you are getting 3 and then whatever you are getting you are adding the remaining number to it that is 3 plus 1 and finally you are getting 4. In this case what you are do doing, you are first performing addition. That is 2 plus 1. Okay, so 2 plus 1 is 3. Then you are performing division. That is 6 divided by 3. So you are getting 2. Okay, but this is wrong and this is correct. Why? Because according to the rules, D mass, first of all we need to perform the division. Okay, so first of all, we need to perform the division. So if we perform the division, 6 divided by 2, we will be getting 3. Then 
plus 1 after that we have to perform the addition so if multiplication is not there if multiplication is there then we have to perform multiplication if it is not there skip it go to the next addition so we are performing addition then 3 plus 1 and that is 4 here what we have done we performed addition first so that is actually wrong okay so you have to be very clear with d mass that is division multiplication addition and subtraction in this order only you have to perform the operations okay now i have various questions over there so let's take the questions one by one and first of all we practice some of the question then you can try the remaining ones okay now first of all I am having this problem 7 plus 5 into 4 now what is the order of operation that we have to write over here D M A S right now we have multiplication and addition over here we don't have subtraction and division okay so no problem between M and A first of all we have to perform multiplication right then we have to perform addition okay so first of all let's perform multiplication I write 7 is it is plus I have to perform this multiplication so 5 into 4 is what 20 okay so this is is equal to this after that I have to perform addition so 7 plus 20 27 that's it isn't it very simple you just have to take care the uh, of the order of operation that's it here also plus and multiplication addition and multiplication so what I have to perform first multiplication so 8 as it is plus as it is 7 into 5 35 then 35 plus 8 43 that's it okay here also I have to perform the multiplication first so 5 as it is plus 5 into 1 is 5 then 5 plus 5 is equal to 10 okay you have to follow the order strictly otherwise you will be getting the wrong answer and you'll be getting the uh, marks deducted for this okay now here we just have multiplication okay so that really doesn't matter whatever order you wish you can follow so 2 into 6 12 12 into 1 is equal to 12 right here we have addition and subtraction so first of all what we will do addition and then subtraction so 4 plus 10 14 and then this is minus 6 14 minus 6 is 8 okay here you'll get negative answer just leave this then we have this 3 plus 8 into 6 so first of all we have to perform multiplication I write 3 as it is plus 8 into 6 is 48 then 3 plus 48 is 49 50 and 51 isn't it very simple okay then we try this here multiplication and subtraction is there so between multiplication and subtraction we have to perform multiplication first then subtraction okay so 7 into 3 21 minus 2 that is 19 okay here here we have division okay so what I do uh, I need to perform division first be between multiplication and division this is division has to be performed first okay so 10 10 into 6 divided by 2 is what 3 now 10 into 3 is what 30 okay it is multiplication and subtraction what I have to perform first multiplication so 9 into 6 54 and this is minus 1 so this is 53 that's it okay now here we have this question let's solve this I uh, just write down the correct order over here it's D M A S now we have division addition multiplication all of them so first of all we have to perform the division 
Now just see step by step carefully I am performing the division first. 10 plus 4 divided by 4 is 1 and then into 9. Okay, this is the first step. Now we are left with addition and multiplication. Addition and multiplication we need to perform multiplication first. So I perform the multiplication. 10 plus 1 into 9 is what? 9. Right? Now 10 plus 9 is what? 19. Okay? Similarly, see here. 5 plus 2 into 3 into 3. So we have to perform the multiplication first. So 5 plus 2 into 3 is 6 and then further into 3. Okay? Then again we have multiplication. So 5 plus 6 into 3 is 18. Right? Now 5 plus 18, 23. Isn't it very simple? See this? Multiplication, addition, both of them are there. So we need to perform multiplication first. So 3 plus 9 into 1 is what? 9 and then plus 3. Okay. Then 3 plus 9 is 12 and plus 3. Now 12 plus 3 is 15. Okay. Oh, oh. This question we have multiplication and division both. Okay. So first of all we need to perform division. So 6 into 3 divided by 9 divided by 1 is 9. Then we are left with multiplication and division. So 6 into 3 divided by 9 is this. Right. 3 divided by 9. So this is 6 into 3, 18 divided by 9, okay? So 18 divided by 9 is 2, okay? Getting me? See this? Here we have multiplication, addition and division. So first of all, we will perform division. 9 into 5 plus 10 divided by 2 is? 5. Okay. Now we have to perform multiplication. 9 into 5 is 45 and then plus 5. 45 plus 5 50. Okay. Now I do 1 or 2 for you. Then you have to do the remaining ones. I do this for you. Okay. This one. Here multiplication and division. So what I perform first? Division. 9 into 8 divided by 1 is 8 and then 3. Okay. Now 9 into 8 into 3. So 9 into 8 is what? 72 into 3. Now 72 into 3 you can do? 216. Okay. So that's pretty simple. You do the remaining sums and then... Uh, just pause the session, do the remaining ones and then match your answer and solution with mine. Okay, I'll do each and every sum for you as of now. Okay, so you can match your answers. Are you done? Now you can match your answers with mine. I have written down the questions and answers over here, the problems and answers over here. So you can pause the session and match your answers one by one. Right? Just be careful while you are matching your answers. Right? And... Uh, for one correct answer, you'll be getting one mark. For one wrong answer, you'll be getting zero, right? So find out how many marks are you getting and just show it to your mama, okay? So just pause and check it now. Now I have some more questions for you so you can have better practice. Just pause the session, do all the sums one by one. Then I'll show you the correct answers and you can match your answers with mine, okay? So just pause the session first of all. I hope you are done. Now just match your answers one by one. You can pause the session once again and you can match your answers. I have written down the problems and their answers, all, uh, both of them together. Okay. So just match your answers carefully. 
uh, one more practice sheet for you so pause the session and do all the sums right so this way you'll be able to practice a lot okay and your teacher and mama will be surprised to see the great results okay so just pause the session okay I hope you are done now just pause the session once again I have written all the sums over here and their answers also now you can match the answers what you have done is correct or not and just write down the correct score of yours okay so kids I hope you are enjoying DMAS and uh, you are able to get good score in all these uh, problems and cheats. I'll see you in the next session once again with some more problems with the uh, questions based on DMAS. Okay, bye-bye.